all the time, executive. To me, an executive, you know what an executive is to me? An executive is a man who gets $50,000 a year, has a, a beautiful office. You can see how excited I'm getting over this. <laughs> but that's what it is. He gets 50000 a year, as I started to say, has a beautiful office, couple of secretaries, but no job. <laughs> Thank you, this. I don't... That, look at this here, carpet. Carpet for executives. Look at that. I never got that as a night. And here comes the CBS executive. Mush! Look at... Mush! 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 I know this is an extravagant waste of money. Here, boy. Take this rug and beat it. <laughs> I don't wait for a vice president to talk. Oh! Hey, what is this whole thing anyhow? We are the CBS Brain Trust. This is our vice president in charge of soap operas. Oh, the vice president in charge of soap operas. How do you do? <laughs> this, this is our vice president in charge of cutting costs. Why, certainly I'll cut the cost right away. There it is, right there. Give me that. All right. Unbutton your coat, stupid. All right. <laughs> Gentlemen, the vicissitudes of one's circumstances in these surroundings makes it nigh impossible to state one's feelings, which entitles you to additional chastisement. Prepare for the double zinger. No, 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 no not, not the, the double, double zinger, zinger. no. <laughs> Executive thing. Put your fingers out like that. Now hold your arms out that way. On your mark, get set. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I've had enough of this, an executive. It's got to stop. I'm trying to do a show. Well, we're going to make a few little changes around here. There'll be no changes. I'm going to do the show myself, and I'm going to start it right now with a camel movie. Well, after the camel movie, we're going to make some changes. There will be no changes. Oh, yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is uh, my suit, especially for picking oranges. <laughs> Naval. Naval oranges. Oh. <laughs> we had such frost this past winter. I have no idea what it did to this citrus crop. <laughs> Look at that. So cold. Frozen orange juice. <laughs> but look at this beautiful scenery. Isn't it gorgeous? Look, look at the pond, the wishing pond, the scenery, the trees, the bird bath. Lots of people have thought of a bird bath before, but I'm the first one to think of this, you know. <laughs> this, I think, is so wonderful. See, isn't that cute? <laughs> the bird. Uh, this is really, I'll tell you what this whole scene is for. It is really to welcome my beautiful and lovely guest, Helen Forrest. Would you play some lovely music for the lovely Helen Forrest? If that's Helen Forrest, television is in worse shape than I thought it was. <laughs> We're going to make some changes around here. Yeah, we're going to make some changes around here. Quiet. Wait a minute. Get what are you... <laughs> You've got to stop this. You've got to stop the whole thing. You're ruining my show. Please. We're trying to help you. I don't need any help. I can ruin my show myself. I don't need <laughs> Just let me alone, will you? Now, you can't do a television show with that pond here. It's very unsanitary. Yeah, it breeds fish. <laughs> I didn't say anything. Well, now, you see, that should teach you a lesson. <laughs> They're making an executive out of me now. This is we got to get rid of that fishing pond. No, here. boys. Boys. Stop. Stop, boys. That is not a fishing pond. That is a wishing pond. Wishing? Fishing. Smishing has got to go. Yes, Get it off. Guys, Terry, wait a minute. I'm going to make a wish. Oh, Helen Forrest, this is just what I wish for.
for it, Helen Forrest. I'm so glad you finally got here. These boys are driving me crazy. Well, who are they, Ed? Well, they claim that they're top brass from New York. <laughs> you know what top brass is. They make uh, pipes for under sinks in the kitchen. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, what is this? What is this? This is a television camera. Take one. <laughs> Just a minute, the television camera. Helen, I want you to see this instrument. This is the instrument that takes a picture of my face and it sends it out all over the country. And millions of people sitting in front of their sets, looking at me, you know, see. And it gives them a chance to say, uh, who's that? Of course, these things we have to see if that set was photographed. Yeah, now, there's right. a matter of a wait a minute, boys. Wait a minute. This is my show. I will look at it. How's the scene, Ed? Well, I can't tell. I'm looking at an old Hopalong Cassidy picture here. You can't. <laughs> Take it over. That boy, Hoppy, gets him every time. <laughs> Look at those trees. We'll have to do away with them. That was... Hey! That's the worst scene I ever saw. That's the worst saw I ever seen. <laughs> He's soaking! Oh, no, He's soaking, boys! Stop it! Wait! I'll be back to you in just a minute. Stop it! Stop it, boys! Boys, boys, this is a wishing pond. Such executive. <laughs> this is a wishing pond. Shall we all make a wish? <laughs> all right. Wait, wait a minute. It's, it's, it's too small a pond for all our wishes. <laughs> Just let me wish alone. Wait, I get a little coin here. Too. I wish. I made my wish, now I throw a coin in the pond. <laughs> Just what I was waiting for, that was the whole thing. Check out the Stoogerama 3 DVD collection for more Stooge rarities.